10 laps of the journey for the final confrontation. Brett Lacey up on pole position. There'll be no start this time around. Yellow is still on display. John Harris moves uh, up track. Sprint Car Association official issuing final instructions. Looks like to Bruce White in car number 86 who has been instructed to uh, move up one. George Tatton will be none too pleased. So that's uh, one more car that George Tatton will have to pass to uh, pick up a win in tonight's uh, ninth qualifying round. Uh, our Brett Lacey uh, will be chasing points too. Remember he won the evening uh, event and then uh, failed to get points in his second. So he's way behind uh, Gary Rush's 24 points here. He needs the win to get 18 points. Sitting on nine points at the moment. Okay, and uh, also sharing that front row was the, uh, the Kiwi driver, Lyndon Kendall. Lyndon Kendall in the New Zealand number 12 car gets the chance to start out of position too. And the pressure certainly on the Kiwi driver who uh, only arrived, uh, uh, I think it was yesterday, from uh, the Shaky Isles. And uh, it's certainly been an introduction to the Kiwi to sprint car racing of this calibre here at PCR. And tonight the pressure on starting from position two in the final qualifying. Green flag flies now. Uh, Brett Lacey from pole position is uh, set upon by uh, the Kiwi who goes by on the inside but George Tatnell jumps out in car number 8. Gorgeous George Tatnell on the high line in advance of Kendall the Kiwi as they run off turn 4. Brett Lacey's been relegated back to uh, position 4 now as Barry Lewis gets by in the double run car. In the Oscorp Couriers car, Barry Lewis is in third, Lyndon Kendall, the Kiwi, is second, and the race leader's George Tatnell. Uh-oh, trouble for the Kiwi as he backs the 12 car round on turn two. The race continuing on as they head off turn four. With George Tadnell, still the race leader. Tadnell up on the cushion, kicking hard in advance of Barry Lewis now. As Lewis inherits second and Brett Lacey inherits third as everyone moves up with the demise of the Kiwi. But not George Tadnell, the race leader, screaming away in the number eight car. Up through turns one and two. Down the back section, this is the final qualifying round on tonight's card with three more heats on Monday night and Tadnell looking towards nine points in his first win for tonight. Tadnell with uh, two thirds so far has only amassed uh, eight points and if he can put this one together this will give him nine and a total of uh, 17 points on the card. A bit of mathematics there. The pocket computer. George Shatnell down the back section. Still well in advance now of Barry Lewis as Brett Lacey picks up the pace on Lewis, running off turn four. Okay, with five laps remaining, five laps remaining for gorgeous George Tatnell. Over the halfway mark, Lewis has kicked away again in advance of Lacey, and it's all further back now to Bruce White in the 96 car. And the uh, tail end is a battling it out as Tatnell, working away at the wheel. A 23-24 season veteran at least as Tatnell, showing a clean set of heels to uh, Barry Lewis, who's also got some 20 years of racing under the belt as he heads onto the main straightaway. And the youngster in this pack is the young Victorian charger, Brett Lacey, the current Australian sprint car champion, sitting in third place. Tatnell slackened off the pace as Lewis closes in. Lacey's there looking for the jump also locked in tight he can throw a blanket over the uh, the top three contenders now as Lacey looks on the inside Tadnell fights back on the high line Barry Lewis has dropped back to third now oh and gives the Aussie champ a big shunt on to the main straightaway the white flags out now with the final spin car lap of the night can Tadnell go the distance Tadnell from New South Wales Lacey from Victoria down into turn three for the final occasion. George Tadnell to be towing his way through that turn now. Comes off turn four. Racing with a late charge, but it's Tadnell. George Tadnell. Tadnell in the eight car picks up the final win and nine points. Brett Lacey in for second in the Australia one car. And Barry Lewis takes third. 
in the triple one car and back then too Bruce White in car number 96 but the final win on the night's card in the windfall, the number eight car now amassing 17 points after the nine point win onto the main straightaway in car number eight gorgeous George Tatnall What a drive from the veteran, hugging the cushion all the way around the circuit as Barry Lewis closed the gap and Brett Lacey who seemed to slacken off the pace but Lacey picked it up and got it all together in the closing stages put Barry Lewis behind him and set sail after Tatnell as they sat up on the cushion and it was smoking tyres off turn four on the final run to the black and white but it was the veteran George Tatnell the uh, second team driver for the Winfield Racing Team puts the number eight car across the wire with nine big points. George Tatnell first in car number eight, second to the Australia number one car of Brett Lacey, third place to the wire was Barry Lewis in the double one car.